Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. Today's video is sponsored by West Kiss Hair. They sent me this bomb curly frontal wig, and I'll be installing it with y'all. This is very beginner friendly, very, very beginner friendly. Not only that, y'all, I have worked with this company multiple times. They never disappoint. So let's get right into this video. I hope y'all enjoy as much as I enjoy collabing with West Kiss. So y'all, I'm starting off with a clean, freshly washed wig. I did go in and bleach the knots on this unit. I didn't really pluck like I usually would, but I did bleach the knots. I will be cutting around my ear, you know, correcting the sizing of the wig, y'all. That step is very mandatory. If not, your wig will probably be too big for your head. But now I'm taking my wax stick and I'm putting it on the front before I use my hot comb to basically melt the hairs behind basically to melt the hairs back i do this because once i'm laying it down like melting the lace into the glue i don't want no extra hairs in the way i don't want nothing to distract it or mess it up so i do tend to use the hot comb y'all this step is up to you but i do find it helpful I feel like everybody should cut their lace, you know, before they glue it down. It's very helpful. I'm using this lace glue that I got from this girl in my city. I didn't have it for a while now, y'all. Surprisingly, I still have some left in the bottle. But I'm going over with one layer of glue. Literally, that's it. One layer of glue. This lasts me about a week, almost a week. I'm letting it dry for a couple seconds, and I'm going in with my rat tail comb. Using a rat tail comb is definitely helpful. It's definitely, definitely helpful. Using a small comb is definitely helpful. Just whatever you can to melt that lace into that glue. Now I'm taking this even spray, y'all. It is the Supreme, I believe. I believe it's new. I'm taking this and I'm taking my milk band and I'm putting it around my wig and letting it sit for probably about five minutes before I come back and get the cut into my lace. Also, I like to hot comb the hair. The heat does help the lace glue melt a little bit. Now I'm taking my razor and I'm cutting off the lace, y'all. Try to get as close as you can to the lace. You don't want no extra lace, literally. So try to get as close as you can to cut all the lace off. Don't get too close because you might end up messing up, but definitely take your time. And then when I do around my ears, I do tend to use my scissors. And I do not go straight across, y'all. I cut it in like a slant. Now I'm taking some concealer, basically just blending it in. 
Now I'm going in with my rat tail comb and parting out my baby hairs. I sometimes I do do thick baby hairs, fluffy baby hairs. It's really all up to how I'm feeling once I'm you know done. If I never really have an exact look on my baby hairs. I literally just put four two by my eyebrows, two by my ears, and literally that's it. That's what works for me. I don't try to do too much extra, you know, none too extra, no curls and all that extra stuff. And also, when you part out these baby hairs, you want to try to get the baby hairs into a C. Like, part out a letter C into it. You get what I'm saying? Just so that the hairs clear properly when you do lay them. I do tend to pluck once I get my baby hairs parted out to give it a better look. Now I'm taking my razor, y'all. Basically cutting the hairs. I don't cut them too short. I don't cut them too long. I cut them enough to where if I do need to go back in and cut them, I still can. It's really all up to you on how you want your baby hairs. Literally, y'all, it's up to you. Now I'm taking this flat iron that I got from Walgreens. It was like $20, $25, y'all. I did get this from Walgreens. It's definitely helpful. It definitely comes in handy. And I'm using this to curl my baby hairs. I tend to curl them out instead of in so that it can lay better once i lay the baby hairs i also do use mousse i found out that mousse does give the baby hairs more of a fluffy look than actually stuck or melted to your forehead So guys, this is the final look. I definitely loved working with West Kiss Hair. Everything about this company will be in the description box, y'all. Literally everything. You also can use my discount code to get money off your purchase if you are interested in shopping with West Kiss. Let them know that I did see you. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to go follow me on Instagram and on TikTok. It will be in the description box, y'all. I definitely love this wig. It definitely was a 10 out of 10 for me. Definitely go shop with them. They never disappoint. Until next time, I will see y'all in my next video. Thank you.